Hello everyone, I am Arun Julkar. Today we will discuss the venue function maximization problem in application of differentiation. Example 1 The demand function of a product is x equals to 20,000 into e raised to the power minus 0.05p. Find the value of p for which maximum revenue is obtained when we talk about revenue revenue is always be price per unit into quantity sold and so capital R equals to small p into x here value of x is 20,000 into e raised to the power minus 0.05 p take 20,000 common so we'll get revenue equals to 20,000 into p into e raised to the power minus 0.05 p. Differentiate respect to p. The derivative of revenue respect to p is 20,000 take common. p as it is, derivative of e raised to the power minus 0.5 p is e raised to the power minus 0.05 p into minus 0.05 plus e raised to the power minus 0.05 p as it is and the derivative of p is 1. Now take e raised to the power minus 0.05 p common. I will get 20,000 into e raised to the power minus 0.05p into minus 0.05p plus 1. In order to find maximum minimum points, put first derivative equal to 0. I will get 20,000 whole multiplied by e raised to the power minus 0.05p into 1 minus 0.05p equals to 0. We know that 20,000 into e raised to the power minus 0.05p is not equal to 0. So 1 minus 0.05p equal to 0. And after calculation, we'll get the value of p 20. Now, in order to find out maximum minimum, we'll calculate second derivative with respect to p. So 20,000 is common. e raised to the power minus 0.05 p as it is, and the derivative of 1 minus 0.05 p is minus 0.05. Plus 1 minus 0.05 p as it is, e raised to the power minus 0.05 p derivative is e raised to the power minus 0.05 p into minus 0.05. Now take minus 0.05 into e raised to power minus 0.05p common and after calculation we'll get minus 100 into e raised to power minus 0.05p into 2 minus 0.05p put p equals to 20 in the second derivative and we will get minus 100 divided by e which is negative so maximum revenue at p equals to 20 and x x equals to 20,000 into e raised to the power minus 0.05 into 20 that's equals to 20,000 divided by e and make some revenue revenue is p into x p is 20 and x is 20,000 divided by e and after calculation we'll get 4 lakh divided by e this is maximum revenue Example 2. A company charges rupees 20,000 for an item on order of 100 or less. The charge is reduced on every set or item by rupees 50 for each item order in excess of 100. Find the largest size of the company should allow so as to receive a maximum revenue. In this example, charges are 20,000 for an order of 100 or less. If the order increased by 1, if it is 100 plus 1, the charges are 20,000 minus 50. If the charges, if the like order is increased by 2, if order is 100 plus 2, then charges are 20,000 minus 50 into 2. So let order size be 100 plus x. And the rate per item is 20,000 minus 50x. Revenue equals to price per unit into quantity sold. Revenue is 20,000 minus 50x plus, sorry, into 100 plus x. By expanding this to e by equation, you'll get revenue equals to 20 lakh plus 15,000x minus 50x square. Now, in order to find out maximum revenue, we differentiate respect to x. When we differentiate respect to x, we'll get dr by dx equal to 15,000 minus 100x. Put dr by dx equal to 0 to find maximum or minimum points. So, 15,000 minus 100x equal to 0. So 100x equals to 15,000 and the value of x is 150. Now in order to check 
maximum minimum we find second derivative second derivative is minus 100 if we put x equal to 150 in the second derivative we will get minus 100 which is negative so maximum revenue at x equals to 150 or we can say that order size is 100 plus x which is 100 plus 150 equals to 250 and maximum revenue put x equal to 150 in the revenue function so revenue equals to 20 lakhs plus 15,000 multiplied by 150 minus 50 multiplied by 150 whole square which is equals to 20 lakh plus 22 lakh 50,000 minus 11 lakh 25,000 which is equals to 31 lakh 25,000 so the maximum revenue is 20, 31 lakh 25,000 when the order size is 250